What is going on, Hurt? Welcome to the channel, and thanks for tuning in to this fresh video of a brand new game here. Monster Energy Supercross number four. Now, I've played number two and number three, and I, I wasn't good at either of them, so I don't really know what I'm doing here, this game, but, uh, well, we're here anyways. I've watched a few videos on this, just enough to know whether I want to buy it or not, and this definitely, like, I love Supercross racing. You gotta kind of support the game, yeah? You gotta support a small game like this. Oh, we got some music. We gotta turn that off. All right, there we go. Get that off. Get the gameplay music off. Turn that off. Now, I did skip the tutorial. I don't know if that was smart, but I had to get that music off. Otherwise, we weren't getting no footage in the beginning here, and this is my first original reaction to this, so... Definitely want to get that. So how do I change my character? I just kind of skipped through. Nick is his... How do you get... What? Nickname Nick out of Milestone. 10-4 on that. Oh, man. This is going to take me forever. Igori Donalon. I'm loving it already. Male. 5'10". 5'10 seems good. Maybe 5'9". Got to make a small rider. You know, the lighter the better. As long as they're strong enough to hold on to that bike. Got to rock the 259. Definitely. 259. Why isn't it giving it to me? Be careful, this number is being used by Corbin Hayes. Tell him to give it up. This is my number. Well, actually, it's not. I mean, it was James Stewart's number, and it really wasn't even his number. It was his buddy's number who, like, got paralyzed or something when they were kids. So, you know, I'll let it slide. Well, what the... Oh, you gotta go with a three-digit number, because we are in futures class here. We are, like, literally coming up. And this is gonna be pretty dang realistic, because I suck at this game, and we're coming up from nothing in this game. The career mode is really what snagged me in. That's really what hooked me. Can I do 159? All right, I'll do 159. I'm not, not thrilled about it, but I'll do it. Gotta wrap it for the home state. Appearance? What do we have for appearance? Head. Can you change their hair? Why do they got all these guys got man buns going on? I like this guy's hair. I'm a fan. I almost want to run him just for that. I don't know if he looks like an Igor, though. That's the problem. Oh, this guy looks like an Igor. I think I definitely looks like an Igor. Yeah, that's him. I feel like Igor Donalon doesn't really have any facial hair. I don't feel like he's really rocking it. We'll go green on the eyes. Green, green looks fine. Accessories, tattoos, I'm not even going to get into this now. We got too much ahead of us here for this. And with that said, we're going to head right into it. Rookie Pro. I don't know why they call this Rookie. This should just be called Lights. So Futures is literally like your locals. Training. So what does training really have? To, trainings are, let's keep scouting here. Abilities. That's how you customize. Oh, so can I, I could have customized from right in here. Son of a gun. Oh, no, I can't. I lied. Abilities. What's the journal all about? Okay, so it's just like your, what your completions are. Oh, oh boy, so we're going to suck. Not only do I suck at the game, but the rider's going to suck in the game. My goodness. That's cool, though. I really do like this. I really like that. My career, my stance. All right, well, I guess the best thing to do would be to, let's take her to training. Let's go right there. The lion, the surgeon, the showman, the snake. The lightning. I don't know what to do. Let's go with the snake. So yeah, as I was saying earlier, the career mode is really what grasped me. I could see that it was an in-depth career mode, and from around two and three, I didn't, I didn't, I don't know. I just didn't seem, it didn't seem like the career mode was very um, in-depth at all by any means. So to see, that, whoa, is this a compound in the background? That's one thing I didn't ever see anybody riding on was like a free mode compound. If that's able to be done in this game, I gotta go there and practice because I'm gonna suck. So what are we doing here? Cross the largest number of gates before the time. Oh, that's easy enough, right? Oh, I don't like this camera mode. Whoa, whoa. Oh, we're time. Oh man, this is gonna not be good here. Zing! Over jumped that. Oh man. Oh lord. Oh lord. Take her easy. Oh, that was it? All right, I'll take that. Oh, tank, tank. How do you... Ooh, first button I tried, and I switched to the camera mode. That's pretty good. I feel pretty... That's accomplishment number one. Well, accomplishment number one is right here. We got it. So what does that mean? Test passed, ability obtained, 400 points. I'll take my 400 points, whatever that means. Level two. Uh, they're just going to keep making us go through this? How far can I go? I'll do another. I did fine in the last one. Oh, no, not in first person. Absolutely not. Oh, 
Alrighty. Oh, I'm gonna miss that one. God damn it. Can I restart this? I can restart. Are you sure you want to restart the training session? The current attempt will be used. What does that mean? No. Okay, we got them all except for that one right there. Facing us and right there. Two scores. So I can try again. I can train again. Level three. Okay, I'm confused. I'm confused. I can just keep going on this? I don't get it. And what is this giving me? I take it that training and like winning races and stuff is going to help me with my skills. Or unlock the skills. So is that the, what the points are? As I said, I only watched a couple videos and it was just enough to make me... Like, do I want to buy this dang game or not? There we go. There we go. I'll get through there. It's all about taking your time here, I'm finding. Alright, so yeah. Like I said, I'm a little confused. I don't really know what the heck I'm doing here right now. Can I just keep going and going? Replay. L1. I don't want to replay it. So, career home. Sure. Yeah, it's the only option you're giving me. Alright, so I'm guessing we just get three attempts on the training and that's what it is. Now I want to go into abilities and see if I unlocked anything. Eight available skill points. Three, six, seven, eight. Oh, okay, so it's the stars that you earn. I'm gathering. I'm gathering. We are learning here. Bike control. Braking. Scrub. Cornering. I mean, cornering. I gotta go with the cornering. Let's do both of those right away. So rookie, I can't get any of the rookie stuff till I'm in rookie. That makes sense. Physical resistance. What is this? Reduces abilities during an injury. Injury. Scrub. I'm not going to be scrubbing or whipping anytime soon. Breaking is sounds like pretty critical. Let's get both of those. Bite control. Increase whip execution. Increase turn speed. Definitely want that. So I went with Honda because we are actually in real world building a Honda right now. And completely stripped it down to the frame and rebuilding it as we speak. So go check that out on Dipstick TV. Not what this video is about by any means. Journal. It wants me to go to the journal. Seconds in the air. Yep, we spent 46 seconds in the air. You're dang right. 46 seconds, that seems a little high. Go to the next weekend. Oh, I'm nervous. Oh no, I forgot to switch the settings. No. Yes, I like a leaf. I need to set the settings. We got to do manual transmission. I want the brakes to be two separate, uh, the, like the two separate buttons. Rear. No, no, we got sucked into it. God damn it, manual transmission. I need. This is gonna be an ugly race. Oh no. The riders are lined up. The gate is about to. L1. And we're off. Alright, so it's just going to be all about... Oh, big crash in the beginning. Wow, we're up front here. That's actually a big shocker. going to be all about rhythm here. That's going to be the big thing for me. And as I go completely off rhythm and case, case, case. And what was that about being in the lead? Because that's over. And it's back. We're back in the lead. If that was the right line there it wasn't it wasn't for me i guess the goal for this one would be podium would be fine with me and just finishing the race in the top 10 would be fine with me i really don't have many expectations for my very first race here problem is our very first race is going to count i do know that the futures is three races i did gather that from the one video that i watched it, the guy was doing his last of three races so i'm guessing this is race one. I thought there was a qualifying round to Futures, though, but apparently not. That might have been the tutorial I skipped, actually. Uh-oh. So far, not too bad. It feels good. I feel like the guy's stiff, but I really can't give you, like, real real, uh, like, first impressions of how the game feels, because I know my guy sucks. And I know that I am completely used to the GTA handling lines. <laughs> and this is, this is not a GTA handling line. But even as opposed to round two and three that I played the Monster Energy Supercross, this guy just feels a little stiff here. Been a while, though. It's been a while. No, don't do that. I think the last time I played Monster Energy Supercross 3 was about... Well, I bought it when I heard that this game was coming out, so maybe that was like four months ago. 
three, four months ago. Uh oh. Oh, that guy was right on me the whole time. Curious to see what difficulty we're on. Oh, he botched that one up. I'm going through this section really nice. I want to throw a whip, but I don't dare because I remember in the beginning, uh, playing round three, I was just, it was killing me more than it was helping me, to say the least. I feel like this is a little bit too easy, but all of the easy settings are on. I'm surprised it doesn't have that little arrow that's uh, pointing over the jump. Is this the main event? Yes, this is the main event. That's another thing I want to switch. I want the qualifying round. I want the uh, the heat race. I won't show you guys a whole lot of it because I'm sure it'll make the videos really long and kind of boring, but I want to be able to learn the dang tracks before I go out there and actually do a main event. This seems like a pretty simple and straightforward track, but... Uh, some of those other jumps, or some of the other tracks that I had seen in the videos were like pretty aggressive jumps. Oh, getting a little squirrely. They're right on me too. Final lap, come on now, hold it down. good not good oh i missed the cutoff son of a gun uh oh he got out of he got out of whack too come on let's clear this get back to him oh yeah that was the right line through there that time the first time i took it right first time i actually seen it that way been just trying to pin it over all these jumps. That's the goal. So as I said, this was probably a little too easy. There's no reason I should have won my first race in this game. Uh, but then again, all of the settings are completely basic, completely stock settings. The checkered flag waves high in the air as this one is it's okay though. It helps me. It gives me all these points here. 55,000 points. All I needed was 10. Oof, we're moving up in the world here. Igori Donalon, though. That's the name you need to be remembering. So I asked you guys in the community tab, do you want to see me do a career mode on this? And about 70% said yes, and about 30% said no, just stick to the GTA. We decided to go ahead and do a career mode. Now, how far we go into this will be up to you guys. It'll be depending on how much you enjoy these videos. So if you do enjoy these videos, make sure you leave a like below. I want to figure out how we get into the compound. Compound, here we go. Compound is a large training area where you can practice and also play different game modes. Have fun. Oh, I'm gonna have fun. 250 East, 250 West. Come on, tell me we can use our rider, right? Official brain science, custom brain science. Ooh, there he is. A gory Donald on himself. Ready to hit the compound. Race options. Very easy. Okay, well, all this is making sense. We'll see if the career mode was set to very easy, but I'm guessing it was. Let's go to just easy. Let's just try easy. Physics, I definitely want everything else on as difficult as you can make it for me. Perfect. Floyd's what I was talking about. That was off. Okay. Well, yeah, that makes sense. Very easy. Seems like it was very easy. There's no reason I should have won that race. Now, I hope next track isn't some difficult track and I take last because that'll kill us. All right, let's do this thing. All I want to do is just ride around for a little bit. We'll probably end this video up here with some compound play. And then I'm going to hop into making a second video where I'll knock out both the last two races. So depending on how these videos do, as I was saying earlier, that's depending on how far we'll go. We'll at least go into the 250 class. We'll do one series to the 250 class. I don't know if we'll go east or west. I'll probably throw a poll up. Again, guys, if you enjoy this, leave a like below. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed yet. Let's get right into the old compound here. What's the bike setup all about? I'm going to leave that alone. I'm not even going to begin. Not even going to begin. And we're off. All right, we got manual trans. That's what I'm talking about. 
All right, this is absolutely amazing. This is what I've been waiting for, this open world thing with this game. Let's just ride the shoreline, see what kind of different terrains we come across here. Oh, goodness. Okay, well, maybe not the shoreline. We'll ride this green line instead. Oh, we got a little track here, okay. What are these? I'm not even getting into it. I'm here to free ride, not do that stuff. feel really, really sluggish and slow in the corners. Definitely got to work on that. I don't know how much to lean, how much to use the, the uh, right stick here. Try a little scrub. Oh, my goodness. Well, we landed that cleanly somehow, but... Oh, that was a whip? Okay. That was a scrub. Okay. All right, well, this is not what I'm here for. I don't really want to ride a track. I want to, uh, I want to explore. I want to ride some trail. Whoa, 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 what the hell is that? Oh, there we go. Nope, went right over that berm. Oh, pff, and into the tree. So all in all, not a bad game at all. I'm definitely enjoying it. A um, little bit, a little bit difficult to kind of get everything down. I've never been good at this game, so I really don't expect a lot. I would not doubt it at all if I just bumped it up to easy, just easy, in that next race, and I, you know, take close to last. Honestly, I might be exaggerating slightly with the easy, but I guarantee you, I put it on medium, and I'm gonna do horrible. So we'll see what happens with these next couple races in the next video. If you do enjoy this, like I said earlier in the video, leave a like below. Let me know. If we don't see a lot of views on this and we don't really get a lot of support, I'm gonna know. You guys don't really want to see this, and we will move on to different things with our time. But I kind of like different games to spruce it up, and we really have not found many other games that we can consistently play and get any type of decent views over a couple hundred. And, uh, you know, I feel like Supercross is a fun game. We do do some off-roading on the channel. I feel like it does fit the bill. And uh, I do kind of want to get into some other drifting-oriented games, too, as we move forward into the future. Some more, oh, I'm not even shifting. I'm just talking to you guys now. Again, as we move into the future, get a few other games as well for the channel. Kind of spice it up. Waiting on GTA 6. Of course, guys, as I always, hope you all stay happy out there. Please stay positive, And we will definitely speak to you next time.